So, <clears throat> um, I'm gonna do a quick recap in a second, but basically we're in Aust we're, we're in Houston, Dallas. Oh my God. We're in Dallas. We're in, we're in Dallas, <laughs> Texas right now. And I'm gonna do, what I, I was planning this whole cinematic thing and I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that in a second, but really quick before we get into the video, Spirit sucks. Um, I booked a car online through their like all-in-one service. First of all, our first mistake was going through Spirit, but I booked a car through their service. It was a Hertz car, and it sat online. It was estimated like a little over two hundred dollars, and I'm like, that's not bad at it all. It was like cheap. <clears throat> it was really cheap, and that's oh, that's the only reason that we did it. So we get here, and they're like, oh, there's a two hundred dollar fee for being under twenty five. There's your insurance is thirty two dollars a day. Which you also had to write online how old you were. Yeah, so I online I told them I was under twenty one, and it still said it was only like two hundred something dollars. So. That happened, and then there was a $200 fee for me being under 21, and then there was a $31 uh, per day fee of um, insurance, and where's the, the thing? It ended up... Hey guys, I can't even... I'm, I got so frustrated. It's $585.45. So my $200 charge turned into $585. And not only that, they put, what is another 200? They put another $200 extra hold on my card. So it's $785. Oh my God. But anyways, we're at Whataburger now because we're starving and it's been forever and we're, we're hungry and I'm hangry. But Haley came up with a really great solution actually to how we can pay for this and, and it all worked out. So we're good on that. We're basically gonna get Whataburger and then go to Waco because we have to drive three hours anyways and we have to go through Waco. So we're gonna stop at Magnolia Silos. <laughs> So you might be thinking to yourself, Brian, hey, how did you end up in Texas and not tell us or document or do anything? You just kind of jumped into it. Well, here you go. First, we got to the airport, we walked through these doors, then we walked down this tunnel into the airplane, which is right here. Then somehow we fit our luggage under the chairs in front of us, or we took off. I had snacks, but Haley didn't have snacks because she was sleeping, then we flew a little bit. Then we watched some Netflix, Haley did watch Netflix with me this time. Then we flew close to the ground, we landed the plane, we didn't land the plane. We walked down the tunnel in Texas, into this weird elevator, onto a bus so that we could walk to get our car, where we met this nice lady. So, hey! Picking our car up? Yes, picking up car. What's your name, Marilyn? Marilyn. Marilyn's yes. being a generous help here, yes. getting us on our on our way. Yes, yes, <laughs> And we see the silos back there. Don't need the GPS anymore. Woo! So this is actually the second time we've been to Magnolia Silos. If you want to see the first time, click the little thing up top. Check that out, it's pretty fun. So if you guys ever watched a TV show, those are the silos that they show in the actual show. It's pretty cool. It's a lot smaller in real in person though, which was interesting the first time that we came. And there it is inside. Still love this place. It's so like peaceful, relaxing. We'll probably just sit here for a little bit. Brian got his mom a hat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's our second time here and definitely not our last, especially if we move to Austin. It's not that far, just a little weekend trip. I love it here. I kind of want to explore some of the antique stores too while yeah, we we're can here. Do that. Yay. So those are the silos. This is like the grass area where you can kind of hang out and play, and that's the store in there. And then behind us are all the food trucks and stuff. You can't really see them, but there's a lot of food back that way. And then that's Haley's. You cold? <laughs> no, just chilling. Look at those. Okay, it's really, really windy, so I don't even know if you can hear, but we are leaving the silos. Sadly. But you're right there. Uh, it's kind of starting to rain, so we're getting out. Well, we're not leaving. There's just an antique store right over here that we're gonna go check out because. I made the sweetest friend. I was sitting on the beanbag chairs while Brian was taking pictures and he kept bringing me all the balls. He was probably like three, <laughs> he could barely walk and he'd just go, ball. I was like, thank you. And I literally just had a circle of soccer balls around me because he kept bringing them all to me. It was a very sweet moment and I'm very sad it was not documented because it, I was, was, taking a it time was so precious and Brian missed it. So while a normal person would pay attention to the silos and all that cool stuff, Haley notices this tiny little <laughs> antique store down this random road. So that is where we are going. I want a picture in front of this, it's so cute. 
Oh, they have bricks. Look at this. This one literally says Mexico on it. These are kind of cool, actually. How much are these? There's no price on This is how you know it's a good, like, thrift store, though, because it's all, like, junk, kind of, like, laid out and just thrown around. That's when it's good. If it's, like, super clean and neat and nice inside, that's normally not a good thrift store. Fun fact. I think we're leaving Waco. Pretty sure. Set are we? Face, yeah. Yes. It was just a quick stop by. Little stop. So we're gonna check out a Waco. Um, and then from here, we have to go to Austin. Woo! And that's Future it. That's home. all we're doing today. So this is where we're staying. The place we're staying <clears throat> is right out here. It's actually really cool. It's really nice. It's like a gated community, so it's like not super. I guess intimidating like we're not just kind of in the random Airbnb or wherever we're staying with Haley's like family friends when they're like a lot younger um, so it's actually it's a really really nice place <clears throat> and then inside is super nice too but we're actually going to HEB now which is down south anybody from down south is gonna be laughing that I'm even saying this but it's like their down south version of like Kroger if you're from the north um, so yeah, that's that's what we're doing right now. Going to get some stuff from H E B Heb. I hope Juan sees. It. I hope yeah, Juan. It gets bigger and Juan. Better. If you're seeing this, I don't know. Haley said you'd laugh at me saying that. Do I go this way? Brian, look. All right, Juan. It's, it's Heb. Heb. <laughs> we're at Heb. We're gonna pick up some hairs products and maybe a backpack. Okay, it's pretty late, um, but we are gonna end it here if you check. Got all my stuff charging for tomorrow and the next couple days, so we'll be able to do some awesome footage with that stuff later. But until then, see you guys in the next one. Where do 